Yep. Back out. After last week, we uh, down here, Mark. We decided not to go out last week because of the biblical rain. But uh, oh, I did not come down as well. That would have just been miserable. So this week. Through the trees, isn't it? Across the bridge. I'm sure, you, I'm sure you're going to be on this side. Through here. We lost our room. Up there. <laughs> We're two yards from the corner. We're lost. And then up there. That big lad up there. Oh. It's not as far as Braden Crags. Oh. But it's that bit at the end when it's like. It's like a vertical wall at the end, isn't it? And you've got a hike up. Hill of tower. No, it is like <laughs> cheap. It's bad. But we'll push on. I go through the trees. I'm right, you know. I'm right. I know where I'm going. So here we are. East it up uh, up here like it took about 20 minutes from the car. Uh, Langley crags. I think these are housey crags. We're confused with the crags. We've got crag confusion. Oh I'm really look at them clouds though. We're expecting we're expecting a lot of wind. Um maybe some rain. Depends. And plenty beer. So Lots of rubbish talked, as usual. Probably don't film that bit, like. Yep. But, uh, just gonna, just gonna go across up there, and then it drops down. It's a mile, right, from here, from the top of that little crag in front. Just here, it's a mile to Hedgehope. So that Hedgehope's a mile away from us. And it looks bad from here. So when you get up, it's like a sheer wall, wall of death. So we're on the mile trek. Still got half a mile to go yet. It's looking bigger, closer you get. A nice little uh, rainbow. People are like, oh, lovely rainbow. No, no, because that means it's raining. <laughs> Rainbows are not good because it means it's raining. It's sort of trying, but it's blowing away from us. So, be alright. It'll be alright. I've got my GoPro back anyway. Might have mentioned that, I'm not sure if I did. Big up GoPro, shout out. Really good customer service, no questions. Gives it back, we'll send you a new one. Boosh. Done. Right. Bye, That's the only thing that I get wrong. That's Tommy Biscuit tin. <laughs> <laughs> Right, we're up the top anyway. It absolutely chucked it down. Coming up, we got drenched. One hour, 50 minutes. <laughs> we got soaked. What's so? <laughs> Legs. <laughs> pants are really waterproof pants. What are you on your waist? Uh, hopefully the wind will dry them off. But uh, we're gonna. Uh, I'm gonna ask him a picture over there, like, because that's the flat edge. This is where I mean, Mr. Stalker pitched when we came up. It was miserable then as well. But in here, this is the shelter. For the beer, the beer shelter. This is uh, Terry's terrace. Terry's roof terrace. Terry, put that up. Terry, you know, Terry, Terry. Tell anyone. Tell Terry, put it up. Terry. That's how Jordy's talk oh. in your life. Jordy's talk like that. Terry, I'm telling you, man, it was Terry. <laughs> oh, wait, man. Wait, I. Oh, wait, man. I can't even understand him myself. I'm still laughing with Billy Biscuit. Billy Biscuit, Terry, Chocolate cods. <laughs> pack of the chocolate cods. Uh, so over there is the big cheviot. Just we've walked this before. We walked up this hedge up the same way, just day packs. We went down there through all that boggy bit. Up onto the next hill, I think it's Blackcomb, across to Scotsman's Cairn up the side of the cheviot. Over the back of there is the Braden Crags. Can't see them from here because it's uh it's like down off the top of the cheviot summit. And then we walk back around. That's a kind of loop, that's a nine mile loop. It's a good one that good day walk. We need gators though, because it's really boggy down there. It was coming up. 
Right, so I think we're gonna get set up and then just sort ourselves out. Right. Come out the wind. It's all right, solid. It's gonna be like this all night though, but um, yeah, it'll be all right. I'll sleep well. We'll just have our beers around the back of the can. Mark's pitched around there. I'll go around later and see how he's getting on. The trousers suit will dry off like damp, but they're all right. All right, I'll just get me, just get all my gear set up and then see where we're at. On four o'clock now. Just get out of the way. It's a lonely, lonely sight, isn't it? So if we come around here, just trip over. We find the Tompo in its natural environment, sheltering from the wind. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Aye. Yeah, okay, like. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's okay. I've got a canny pitch here. Aye. Mine's alright once I get in. Aye, once you're in. Aye, I don't like standing out, outside of it though. <laughs> it's a bit windy. 27 mile an hour. That was the maximum I recorded. It's still strong, man, but even 27 mile an hour. Aye. Really Wild, wild, wild. And the rain's on. The rain's on, folks. Yeah, box around the back of the um, can, but I'm just on the side of it, right on the top, right on the exposed bit. There's no shelter from here, but you know, that's what the tents are for. Should be alright, should take it. It'll be a bit noisy, like. Brought me, uh, brought me winter bag. It's cold enough for it. It's time. Right. Sun's going down over there. Sun's going down over there. Rain's here. Weird. Weather is mad. Let's see what happens. Well, 
has turned to absolute shit. That's the rain, folks. And the wind. Do you know how long this rain's on for? No, oh, that's a nightmare. It's been 10 pound. Pain in the arse. Oh, look at it, man. Right. Marks out of... Marks out of reach. I can't even talk them. So... Gonna have to sit it out. Got my tins, got a can on. What a disaster. Welcome back to the world of Wardle's Wild Company. This is more like it. Ah, yeah. <laughs> now it was squashed in Mark's tent. That's the rear on, folks. Social distancing still, like. Well, I saw some distance in. He's his meter away. It's only a meter now. <laughs> Because we're nearly in Scotland. Ah, we're nearly in Scotland, by the way. I can. 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 Bruce. That's, a, that's why the rain's on, folks. Can. Bruce. That's what situation is it? Uh, that's what it's like. I've come around here because my tent's just getting battered. Like. Noise, really. That's probably triple hazy brew dog. Nine percent. Woo! Nine percent. Telling me second beer. The hell with it. Mm. Oh, hi. Because it's a harsh boot, offer. Boot beer holders. Aye, boot beer holders. Boot, boot beer holders. I invented this. <laughs> Aye. It's not very good in low light, this. Sorry, when it's picking this up. This reminds me of that angle tonk cap we did. Yeah, we'd, aye. We'd had several paints beforehand, though, hadn't we? Yep. We had me can of death. Oh, God. We had four paints or five paints oh. in the pool. Then we walked up. Took my tent up, then the rain started. No, it was it was snow. Oh, wasn't snow, it? I snow came in, alright. Yeah, that was bad. That's a, that's a real one. That can't make. We survived, like. Aye, ah, yeah, we'll put it for some good weather, actually, didn't we? We'll get the brakes. <laughs> Definitely not about the views, I need to. We had the best view coming up. When we got to the top, the, um, the weather cleared, and we got the best view I've ever seen up here, like. You could see for miles, couldn't you? Yeah, Literally, it. like miles. You could see Blythe from here, like that's 40 miles away. Quite clearly as well. And Farn Islands, the Bamber Castle, you could see all that. Lovely. My brother, my brother lives in Blythe, that was waving and it was that clear. I think he was waving back. And then it just turned <laughs> absolute shit. <laughs> That's not what happened. <laughs> it just went crazy. It really did go bad. It's, the rain's off a bit now, but God, it came down. Ah, it's cold still, though. Uh, it's chilly well, we'll warm up. I'm going to get another beer. You just, you just opened that one? No, I'm going to have another one. I want two on the go. Two on the go. Oh. Right, we've come up with a top tip. Right, I've been doing this for years, I've just never mentioned it. I've just never done this before. It, it's good, it works. Just put your gloves on your feet. Alright. It's ideal. And you know what I need? Is a light for the GoPro, because all I'm getting is the shadow of the GoPro. Aye, the shadow. So, you put your gloves on your feet. I mean, we have turned into cheesy yetis, but it's working. All right. Keeping your feet warm, isn't it? Oh, nice and warm, aye. My hands are getting cold. Why, my hands are <laughs> <laughs> you Put your socks on your hands. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? These two daft lads. Clap, clap your hands. Um. All right, so that's top tip. <laughs> Bring a spare pair. <laughs> <laughs> Round of applause. Chief Yeti. Round of applause. <laughs> oh, oh, you had two cans of beer. I know. I'm going to have a can in half. I mean, that too. Right. Oh. I think we're mad. I think we've gone mad with the wind. <laughs> the wind's got a mental. Curry <laughs> star. Oh, me. hey. <laughs> I'll go to the foot of our stairs. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Right. oh man. Morning cat was hiding high now, nothing. Not a thing. Not even anything. Not one thing. Nobody. Nobody's daft enough. Look at it. Look at it. Absolute 
scenes. Oh dear. Well, windy night like. It's been like this all night. Never stopped. So we're gonna, um, I don't know what Mark's doing. Half past eight. Slept all right though. I slept um, up until about five o'clock and then I had to get up for a natural break. And then I got back in and just went back to sleep. So the wind didn't really bother us. But it is wild. But you know, it's wild camping, isn't it? We knew it was going to be windy. Just wanted, uh, I think Mark just wanted to tick this one off his list of camps on um, Cheviot Summit. This was the last one, Hedgehope. I've camped here before, like, and it was the same, pretty much the same. There was more rain on that one. Yeah, so I'm going to get the kettle on. Kettle on, folks. Have a coffee. Oh, and then pack up. Pack up and get off this mountain. Oh, make like a tree and get out of here. Alright, so we'll see what happens. That was Mark just just telling us to check in. Well that's a tent away. Woo. Just uh just the patch. Get them put away. Look at this man. You don't need a time lapse. Yeah. Okay, let's get going. Here we are descending the slope of terror. And it is a slope of terror. It is a slope of terror. It's not nice to walk down that. Good job we've got our pools. Makes life a bit easier. So we're gonna head down here, across there. That's a mile, you know. From the bottom there to there is a mile, exactly. And we'll get from here. And then just down the side, another slope of death. Woo! <clears throat> that was a windy one, that. <coughs> God, got a frog in my throat. So, that's about it really, unless anything exciting turns up, we'll just leave it there. Gross! What are you saying? What are you saying? Let's just keep away from my eggs. Yeah. It's got a fan in it. Eggs must be here, boy, Funny little thing. Uh, it's got uh, gust, gusto. Look at it, it's got a gun at him. <laughs> Just giving the game away by protecting them. Coming, <laughs> coming. Are you coming back in the tune with us? Come on, nice, coming, look. He's having it. He's following that group. He's definitely having it, like. There you go, bit of grouse. 